of fun. Hi everyone, this is Chicho. Welcome to my channel and welcome to another live stream. Today, today is March 14th, 2021. And we're doing a kitty cat uh, playtime live stream. We got a couple of kitty cats. Uh, here, let me show you a couple of kitty cats. Sleeping beside it, behind us. Okay. And uh, they've been sleeping for a little bit of time. So they've had a good sleep. And uh, we'll wake them up slowly as uh, people start rolling in and give them a little workout. Uh, that's what the plan is. <laughs> I've seen my kittens. <laughs> they're funny this morning. They're, they're up early. The time uh, early, well, like we had daylight savings today is it daylight savings or the other one i don't know but we move the clock forward an hour that affects us because we go by a 24 hour you know set clock thing and we talked about time and stuff like this but kitty cats don't care <laughs> so they were up <laughs> earlier going <laughs> run around and stuff uckleberry chicho how are you doing hey chat how's everyone doing doing fantastic man starting a nine live stream set with a kitty cat live stream which is fantastic our cat mr pie haha <laughs> says hello to you guys awesome i'm seeing my <laughs> mr pie i like his name i like his name awesome diet dog how are you doing been a long time indeed man right been a long time indeed we got the here let me give you the lay of the land well before i give you the lay of the land let me give my little intro and then um as people pop in we'll let everyone know what we're up to and stuff i got three different angles uh, well we got this angle we got one angle at the bottom here and another one up here this is the camera shooting down we're gonna get a top view um maybe get the kitty cats doing jumps there's one toy we have that they love jumping really high so i thought it'd be cool just to see them coming up to the thing right shirtless kylo how are you doing man long time hey chicho got your honey it's so good what's up chat awesome shirtless kylo <laughs> finally the honey got there diet thug one day one day i will make a 10 by 10 game a game stream awesome diet thug we, it's been a while well no we, we did one in the, in the fall i believe uh so come spring we'll do another 10 by 10 live stream as well try try for that hundred try try for that hundred <laughs> gang if you want to know what this work is about i am on patreon patreon.com forward slash chicho c-h-y-c-h-o if you want to follow this work if you want to support this work if you want to know what this work is about which is basically layered on mathematics patreon is a great way to do so i don't put anything behind paywall everything's creative commons share and share a like and gang for those of you that were supporting this work on patreon thank you very much for the support gang it is in large part because of your support that we're able to do this and i mean that from the bottom of my heart man uh we wouldn't be here at this stage doing everything that we're doing if it wasn't for the support on patreon so gang thank you very much for that support uh sure Skylar like chicho uh any suggestions on things to eat honey with how uh, one of the things i eat honey with a lot well i put it in my tea and not all the time right every now and then uh, with lemon fantastic oh, wow, wow, wow. Uh, the other thing is toast get some nice bread not crap bread nice bread sourdough seedy bread right like nice bread right find a farmer's market go find some nice bread make a toast right make a toast get some butter you need butter unsalted butter grass fed unsalted butter it's a little expensive but well worth it right or coconut oil okay put it on and then you put the honey on and then you eat it <laughs> while the bread is warm it's crazy delicious man that is the way i eat majority of my honey is eaten like that okay also with yogurt put it in yogurt mix it up with fruit and stuff so good so good apples is good with it just dip apples and honey and eat it up uh, tahini get some tahini and open it up with honey so tahini is bitter tart tart bitter i guess tahini oil 
right or tahini sesame seed oil but tahini and open it up with maple syrup or honey honey is great and we make our honey 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 chocolate chip cookies another way i eat them fry up eggs right fried eggs over easy or sunny side up right uh toast cheese and honey man if you never had fried eggs with honey like put it put the honey on toast and spread put a little bit on the eggs too maybe with bacon oh my god with bacon so good so good <laughs> that the uh, sure this guy though yogurt top with uh, granola and that uh, yeah fantastic i'll go berry i love good beer uh bread i miss having a toaster i'm not allowed to have one living in a dorm oh oh no toasters in a dorm crapola yeah it makes sense though it makes sense though toasters if you're not careful if, if they're not clean the stuff they can't catch fire you got to be careful ding bob or chicho what is your absolute favorite meal i think brother i don't have an absolute favorite meal there's certain foods that i eat a lot of right i love certain meals i i absolutely love but i don't i either don't make them often or um I only eat them out sometimes like rack of lamb is crazy good right I've yet to perfect rack of lamb I gotta start trying more right but when I go out to a restaurant of sort of high-end gourmet restaurant stuff like this uh, if a gourmet restaurant high-end restaurant if they can serve you an amazing rack of lamb that's a good restaurant it's like going into a ramen noodle place japanese ramen and getting a shio i think it's shio shio ramen if they can make a shio ramen very well right that's a good ramen place right mm, heck yeah i'm on it shirtless kind of says oh man i'm hungry now i don't see mike <laughs> <laughs> I thought I'll go where Chicho something about a fire hazard something about something about a fire hazard my wallet just that thing my wallet just jumped out of my pocket when you said rack of lamb yeah expensive it didn't used to be that expensive but it is now gang we are live streaming on twitch if you want to participate in the chat twitch is where you want to be at and gang thank you very much for the support on twitch thank you for being here thank you for the discussion void hook how are you doing nice setup yo thanks <laughs> thank you for being here thank you for the bids follow subs and mods thank you for taking care of business we do announce these live streams we're down to four on parlor minds gab and vk twitter is out too much censorship f twitter right twitter is gone we're not we're not we're not active on twitter no more they ban bit shoot links they ban bit shoot links f twitter we're out of twitter so if you guys are following our work on twitter we're not on twitter no more <laughs> i do have the account there but put a little f you on twitter and we're out right until they allow bit shoot links we ain't going to participate and the odds are we're not going to go back anyway so anything jack dorsey touches is poison right any 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 tech that you're on platforms that you're on that jack dorsey is a executive uh whatever it is funding it or whatever it is get out of there that's what i'm doing yeah man screw jack dorsey he looks like a <laughs> i'm gonna allow that i don't know if it's it's uh it's uh it got through <laughs> okay uh so those are four platforms we're on and we do have a discord page you can come our to our discord i gotta change this uh notification and in uh you can go to our twitch channel and in the chat type in exclamation mark social and all the links will pop up i have to take out twitter so twitter is gone and lo something happened as well at the same time uh, i can't log into my hello account i can't retrieve the password it doesn't recognize me so if i can get on there i'll get on there if not hello is out too okay hello is, is a great platform by the way fantastic platform it's very art related but we're loading on some political stuff um it's more geared towards the arts right but we're loading on some political stuff maybe it didn't 
jive well with some people i'm not sure what's going on i'll try again right but they're not on the bad list they're they're a good social network uh for arts if you want to follow the arts and stuff okay uh, and we do have a discord page and the link was at the bottom there uh ding bobber anybody here ever hear of hero dreams of sushi no that guy charges a few hundred for a 15 minute meal of simple sushi i enjoyed a few hundred i enjoyed that documentary so much i watched it like three oh nice chicho we need a uh sensor to room sort of name for twitter <laughs> twitter just f twitter that's the, that's the name for twitter f twitter man twitter's out f them they like seriously they're they're as bad as facebook right f facebook f twitter done any idea why they banned bitshoot links uh, that's so because they, they they don't want information any any discourse legit discourse to be within society after it's a cult right there are lots of amazing journalists there that have twitter accounts and stuff that i i did follow i read their stuff but my recommendation to them is man they're 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 they censored the president of the united states legitimate news sources the oldest newspaper in the united states that censored it right and they don't allow a platform video sharing platform where we upload everything right we don't upload everything to censor to we upload everything to bitch you then they're banned why would i go there like it doesn't make sense f twitter all right check your stream yay and see my yeah man screw jack <laughs> it's like an art target out choo choo but like i went to a greek spot uh called the uh, parthenon ah parthenon hey, there used to be a cliff jumping place we went to parthenon it is a three-story restaurant i had to order the pasta dish with lamb and a platter came out with a leg of ram lamb on a nice yeah it's the leg the shank it would have been the shank lamb shank is so good i do i you know what it's time for me to cook another lamb shank are you the fake choo choo evil duo <laughs> i'm sure let's get us the slightest thing love out i see like big tech like hey these guys are doing some critical thought that's dangerous wrong thing we better censor them that's what it is right dub xyz oh my god please teach us how to cook lamb shank on stream okay okay i will we've done a little bit i've, I've cooked lamb shank before in stew and we made lamb shank with with a persian rice that rice dish it was fantastic super delicious and gang for live streams when we don't have any visuals but we will have visuals today we got two kitty cats today the audios will be uploaded to soundcloud as a podcast and they should be available on your favorite podcasting platform and we will be uploading this live stream this video to sensor to pitch shoot and rumble and if you have enough points we'll put it on odyssey as well uh, i don't have enough points to upload there right now so as we get i don't know how the points are gathered but it will be on sensor to pitch shoot and rumble and there's a handful of you guys that are supporting this work on sensor tube through sensor tube membership there's a button there thank you very much for the support gang it is in large part because of the collective support we're getting on all these platforms that we're able to do what it is that we are doing okay so gang thank you okay let me take these guys down dish, dish, dish. i'm assuming i'm hoping notifications have gone out i'm not a half percent sure on this deal the times have changed right like um uh, what do you call it time zone we move the clock forward an hour so <laughs> people might have thought it was an hour earlier <laughs> ding bobber if someone's pulling the strings um, of the flow of information all we can do is cut them from our own uh shoulders indeed by watching people like you show ah, thanks ding bobber that like they did that's how i got here that's how i got here did you change your life is that the way you found yourself here oh the notifications okay okay i'm thinking about i'm still thinking about the what do you call it banning the notifications went out awesome awesome aren't we getting rid of the time change in bc no they kicked it in again as far as i know it's kicked in again right 
we changed our time. It is what it is. Let me let me give you the lay of the land, gang. Should we wake the kitty cats up and give them a little workout? However, I didn't see a Discord notification. Oh, okay, so Discord hasn't gone out yet. Major Shark, how are you doing? Chicho, hope all is well, my friend. Much love, much love to you as well, brother. Or sister. Or shark. <laughs> Let me give you guys the lay of the land. Should we start playing with the kitty cats? We gotta wake them up. Wait, I missed it. So you're against all forms of all forms of censorship. Philly boy, nah, 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 nah. No censorship. No censorship. No book burnings. I don't give a rat's ass what that book is. Okay. If it's garbage and people are getting confused and misinformed, then debate, right? If it's garbage and people recognize it as garbage, then it won't get a foothold in our society. The way things, bad ideas get for, footholds in society is because they become a cult. And definition of cult is things are secret, right? Lift the veil. No censorship. End of story. I don't care if they're censoring my speech or someone else's speech. MC Mike. It's like what James Corbett says. The mob is uh, coming to burn down the library of Alexandria. Indeed. Indeed. Right? Gina, how are you doing? Hey, you chicho and chat. Do you stream from the upstairs area in the background sometimes? Uh, yeah, I have done a couple of streams upstairs, two, three streams upstairs, I think. Uh, I think all of them were comic book related. <laughs> That's my work area. I go up there and do my do my thing. Actually, the whole house is my work area, I guess. Time to wake the cats. Time to wake the cats. Release the kitties. Release the kitties. Elder God, how are you doing, chicho? Have I lost an hour somewhere? Uh, it, time zone went we changed our time zone here so all the times got all messed up so it was supposed to be we set it up for 11 but we moved the clock forward an hour so it's really 10 o'clock my time that i'm starting so your time yeah i think that's what's going on huckleberry chicho i fully agree let a garbage show itself as garbage the best way to let bad ideas be disregarded is to let them try and fail to stand on their own indeed indeed and when there's censorship is centralized power censoring and then what happens with that is they control the flow of information so if they're censoring they can censor anything they want and just spew out propaganda hello world right that's where we are right now but that's politics we can talk about that tomorrow uh ding bobber chicho what do you think of the statement quote nothing is caused by anything everything happen happens in and of its own doctor um i don't know no i could i can do something i can go wake up the kit, kitty cats right now which i'm about to <laughs> philly boy fair enough i have always had something of an issue with people censoring hate speech because there's no clear definition of what is and and uh, they can twist it to mean whatever they want indeed welcome to central power the modern miracle gina says of daylight savings time still valid in my notes <laughs> insanity insanity kitty cats kitty cats let me give you lay of the land gang let me give you the lay of the land okay this is our space in large part right fun those are those are the two two kitty cats there sleeping right there <laughs> okay we got we got i officially hate the politics <laughs> indeed we got this view let me show you this one when we get the kitty cats we're going to do a bottom view like here okay so this is sort of their play area there's the play area is a lot bigger by the way the play area goes around here and they're They've grown up, they've gone faster, so they're like they run around, they're crazy. But this is one area they come to a lot. They love this guy. They love this guy. Okay. Via loves this guy the most. Hi guys. <laughs> they're slowly <slowing> with you. <laughs> and check this out. Nice bad, thank you. And here's another view we got. Here's another view we got and we're going to do this view right here okay we have one toy where the kitty cats jump up 
So I'm gonna get in, getting them to jump up to about this height, I guess. So I thought it'd be cool just to, and we can adjust this, you know, just to see how we wanna the view to be, okay? But for now, let's do this. Let's do this. Gang, thank you for the follows. Thank you for the subs. Thank you for the discussion. Uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to wake the kitty cats up. Gang, have a great conversation. I'll come back and check on the chat a little bit once we give the kitty cats a little break. But I'm going to wake them up. And what's going to happen is most likely I'm going to go hit their drawer. We have their toys in a drawer. Some of their toys that with the strings attached and stuff, right? So as soon as I open the drawer, the odds are these two little kitty cats are going to run this way. <laughs> Maybe. Okay. If they don't, they'll come and play as soon as we do it. And as soon as I get their toys, I'm going to put on the bottom camera first and just give them a little slow run around here. And then we'll do top camera depending on which toy we're going to go with, right? Let's check it out. Hi, guys. Hi, <laughs> turn on the camera hold on <laughs> let's do this Asleep. He's just holding on.
you guys want the moth? We want the moth. Oh! <laughs> Did you cough up some hairballs? That is disgusting. <laughs> Don't eat it, guys. Don't eat it. Hold on, hold on. Don't eat it. Don't eat it. Wait, wait, wait. You guys play on this while I clean that shit up. <laughs> Classic. Don't eat it, don't touch it. Leave it alone, leave it alone, leave it alone. Beautiful live stream. <laughs> Ew, gross, gross, gross. This one, this one is the bird, and Sal loves the bird. As far as the moth goes, check this out, this is the moth. It's like... <laughs> you guys want to see a top view? Check out the top view, man. Check out the top view. Hold on, let's check it out. Hopefully this comes out okay. Check this out. Come on. Did you get it? Did you get it? It's like crazy for this. <laughs> That's to the side view. That's to the side view. Oh, fun. It's 
Sal, are you okay? You did a little vomit. You okay? Yeah? You okay? Yeah. Usually Sal goes crazy for this too. Via's more for this. Yeah, what's up? I don't think Sal is feeling too good. He loves the bird though. Oh, he's going to the camera. Come on, Sal. Not a hairball. Oh, oh no, he's vomiting. <laughs> he, just, he just vomited some food. I gotta get rid of it. I, I think they ate too much. They should have uh, been digesting. We woke him up too early. Oh, you're gonna eat this? Okay, hold on, hold on. Here, you play with it here.
feeling better. Yeah? Yeah. You're feeling better too. You need to get that out of your system. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, let me do this too. Okay, you play with this. Sal's one of favorite toys. He loves grabbing it, just destroys it. This is the second one he's going through. And you.
this is the one you want. This is the one you want. And let's close this off. This guy? There you go. There you go. You want this one, don't you? You want this one, yeah.
Okay, let's give him a little break. Let's give him a little break. Let's give him a little break. We had a special show today. <laughs> Two kitty cats vomiting. <laughs> camera switched on. Camera switched on. I should have switched the camera already before sitting down. Uh, which one is Sal? Sal is the fast one. The one that chases the bird. Like, fo, fo, fo. He does sprints and he goes crazy, like super speed mode for a few minutes. And then he goes and lays down. Via was the one that was... Uh, uh, I like this view. Yeah, you like this view. Camera switched. <laughs> this view shows. The, we don't see the kitty cats though. And Via is the one that likes the moth. That uh, it's like just a wire with cardboard at the end, and it just dingles like that. And he makes like a kitty cat, like that sound that you heard. He makes it for the moth, really, or when he's just waking up and he just wants a little cuddle, right? And there's a little sound that they make when they're looking for the moth sal is the quiet one <laughs> elder god <laughs> fun fun they they're they're actually they're uh, this is the first time they've not felt good uh, back to back so um it could be they might have eaten a little bit too much uh, this morning I fed them twice they were just they wanted more food so I gave them more food uh, and then they passed out so that's what they're doing that's what they're doing they're both very chill right now hi how you doing hmm? This one's Sal. Take a look. This one's Sal. See the ears? They're very sharp. Oh, off you go. And he doesn't like being held up too much. He's feisty. I'm officially finished in the pub on the 30th of March. You're done? Time for a new adventure. Closing shop, Elder God? What? Punching just, uh, uh, puck, puck happy. Elder God. Punching just seems so dangerous. Could you not? Have restrained him. I am pretty much also this conversation going. Uh, Spark 3D. I think this emote is actually pretty good. What is it? Don't do emotes that often, to be honest. What is that emote? That's a GLHF pledge. I don't know what GLHF is. Void, how you doing? <clears throat> is there a huge visible difference between your cats? How, how you tell uh yeah there if you look at the ears sal's ears have uh they're sharper so that's one way of telling the way they behave for sure this one you know, this one's via and when you pick him up he's just like chill <laughs> he's like yeah they're nice usually he's like yeah hug me love me and Sal is no. Sal doesn't like it. Sal's like, leave me alone un unless I want you to hug me. And then when he wants you to hug him, he comes over and he gets some hug time. And uh, Sal's hair is longer, silkier. Via's less so. Via's crazy smooth until you feel Sal and you go, wow. Got to refine the edges in second, but cool. You're creating your own emotes. Fun. And they end up playing with each other a lot. I'm going to change the view so you see them. <laughs> they just finished. One of them just picked up the little mouse and ran away with it. Did you buy them? Found them? Uh, we, we bought them. My partner. My partner really wanted cats. So. Uh, initially, we we're just gonna get one, 
and then uh, there were brothers and uh, ended up getting two because they entertain each other they play together uh, so she she bought them oh you just made one Chad wanted a cat emote so is the emote the one your GL HF pledge that you're doing which one is the cat emote oh it's on discord you said I think you said it was on discord <laughs> nice is it I'll have to check out the discord look at you I'll, I'll look in the discord where'd you post it just a uh, general I guess right can I take a look I'll take a look right now hopefully I won't get kicked out let's check it out oh fan art ah that looks great <laughs> awesome that looks fantastic man nice thank you so we can save it and use it yeah awesome sparky that's great it's for Ishicho. Awesome. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. That's great. Uh, I saw extreme measures sometimes. Chicho, is good your cats are indoors where they would single handedly shift the balance of nature? <laughs> Fun. They're good kitty cats, man. They're good kids. They really, it's, and it's their behavior is so different. We do let them out. Uh, sort of try to do it on a daily basis. We haven't that much because we're really busy and um just haven't had the chance but usually on a daily basis when we let them out via uh or sal sal goes exploring sniffs around and goes out via as soon as he's outside he just sprawls on the ground and just rolls around like a dog it is the trippiest thing i've ever seen he goes and just rolls around on the ground like a dog and stretches it's like and he does this like the most like 80 percent of the time he's outside he's on the ground stretching <laughs> it's like in a 10 minute period right whether you pay me or not is up to you i don't mind either uh spark okay a, a spark there's something we wanted i want to do with fan art as well uh is i want to start making t-shirts and uh and whatnot uh, but uh, more on that stuff later so put it in fan art and if uh and anybody really if you if you have fan art go to our discord put on our fan art and there's one i want to use where it says we have to decentralize up the yin yang i have to contact the person that made it and see if it's okay for us to throw on a t-shirt and i'm okay with whatever the going rate is to uh for people to get uh or you can modify the fan art a little bit or you know whatever i'm gonna contact uh it's p p, p. jones uh posted it i think uh during the lockdown i started to work on my photoshop and uh procreate skill so i wouldn't mind having this with the thing with the same saying really dang we need to decentralize up the yin yang uh as i put it on a t-shirt i wouldn't mind that actually that would be fantastic chicho, chicho. yeah elder god i'm looking at Ch chicho uh t-shirts um there's a few that i wanted to do and um just generate like it goes into personal finance right just generate another revenue stream uh and uh people have been asking for t-shirts and sort of certain slogans and stuff to go on there so might as well do might as well do uh and i think it's legit and i need to get some more t-shirts so why not get your own t-shirts if you're gonna use it i suggest using the second one second one okay awesome sparks thank you we'll keep you posted stay on our discord we'll keep you posted yeah i'm a graphic designer let me know i'm more than happy to awesome uh uh spark we got to do this we got to do this i'm not outrageously expensive like other guys so yeah i like for me i'm on a budget man <laughs> right? I, I just, like uh, i don't put anything behind paywalls man i've been doing this uh for a while so for me i'm not sitting on the dough i'm sitting on the content uh, and that for me is money right thing bobber well my team won that game i was first with 
10 kills. Oh God, I should really learn how to defend myself. I know a little bit about the Taekwondo. Taekwondo and gang, don't forget. Free Assange, Free Assange, Free Assange. Julian Assange is a journalist and publisher that is being crucified for trying to bring transparency and accountability of capitalist power to humanity. For more information, see wikileaks.org, uh, defend.wikileaks.org, or our Julian Assange and WikiLeaks playlist on Sensor, Sensor 2. I also do overlays, animated alerts, 3D objects, and a little bit of C, uh, CSS. Awesome Sparks. And we have a self promotion folder in our discord so you're definitely welcome to promote your content there as well okay and uh if people you know need a little bit of <laughs> do you guys want to see the kitty cats play stuff do you guys want to see the kitty cats play more they just love it let's check it out what you doing in the corner here you going crazy? You going crazy with the with the mouse? You love this mouse. You love this mouse. This is Via. Ah, oh, sorry, this is Sal. And here comes Via.
Mana dulu snack. Masih di gas snack. We've set it up for them to be have two areas where they can look outside uh, and just chill, watch the world go by, right? They like it. <laughs> Fun. Nice chill day. Nice chill stream. Nice chill stream. Gang, I hope you guys have good snacks. I got apples. Cats are so different than dogs, crazy. Gang, thank you for your follows. Caroline, welcome to our live stream. Chicho, I'm eating the purplest grapes I've ever seen right now. Nice. I can't wait for our grapes to come in again this year. I'm gonna make more grape liqueur. our schedule for the next eight days and hopefully in there there's going to be a comic book live stream as well but here's our schedule our next scheduled live streams tomorrow night at 8 p.m pdt now i guess 8 p.m pacific time west coast of canada current events on tuesday uh, march 16th we're going to do uh, open discussion on food and health on thursday march 18th at 11 a.m we're doing comic book reading okay on friday march 19th at 11 a.m we're going to be grading some comic books okay on sunday march 21st we're going to look at some more minerals and crystals under the magnifying desktop magnifying lamp that should be cool on March, Monday, March 22nd and 11 a.m., we're doing drop in math tutoring session number 72. On Tuesday, March 23rd at 10 a.m., we're doing Chicho Salvia Divinorum Chronicles Part 2. Okay, discussion. Uh, I'm going to share a little bit more about my experience. Okay and that will not be loaded onto the current events and that are not going to be loaded onto sensor tube and on wednesday march 24th we're doing another personal finance and investing uh live stream and this one will probably uh if i get the time we'll probably set it up to look at some stocks and some of the metrics and whatnot chicho i need to stream i went hiroshima on a guy last night yeah elder god the tension is insane it's creeping into our discord i'm like <laughs> yeah good good i'm glad it's it's uh it's helping out all their god it's nice it really people forget people forget you want to see the kitty cat more i 
Hello, Maddie. Hope you're doing well. It's a little bright, right? So, Elder God, our next nine scheduled live streams on Twitch. Kittens, March 14th. That's today. Current events, March 15th. Food and health, March 16th. Uh, reading comics, March 18th. Grading comic books, March 19th. Uh, crystals and minerals, March 21st. Uh, Math, March 22nd. Salvia Divinorum Chronicles, March 23rd. And Personal Finance, March 24th. And there's going to be comic book haul in there somewhere. I'm waiting for two comic book hauls to come. Hopefully they come before the reading on Thursday. One of those books I want to include in the reading. Gina, when told the reason for daylight savings times, the old Native Americans said only a white man would believe you could cut a foot off the top of the blanket, sew it uh, onto the bottom of the blanket, and you'd be left with a longer blanket. <laughs> Gina, so it's insane to me. It's insane to me. I can see the purpose of it in a weird kind of way, but not really. It's crazy. It's crazy. <laughs> You're gonna end up with a longer blanket. <laughs> I can honestly tell you, just knowing a little bit about history and just cultural stuff, any society that was close to nature and was tribal would have looked at the European migration, right? into other lands to take over their land and their mindset and philosophy and the way they treated human beings nature just what they thought life was they would have looked at these societies these people coming over and they would have they would have went how in the world are these people still even alive right you would have you would have looked at them as if they were insane and there's no way there were that many of them right that's maybe one of the reasons they really didn't pay them too much heed uh, unfortunately think bob or chicho about what i said earlier uh about there being no cause of anything uh it, it doesn't cause a doesn't cause b which causes c it all just is as it is and happens spontaneously and that i agree with there is no time factor to it really to a certain degree it's hard to grasp but i can see how it's true yeah like one of the things that you experience through antiogens uh, heroic doses or whatnot is there isn't a past present and future there just is right everything occurs simultaneously to a certain degree that is true that is true especially when you cut the cord uh, to the control of time right it's more about daylight uh, for farmers yeah that's that's the take i've seen on it as well i look god so they could get out and you know plant the seeds earlier and stuff like this so um to a certain degree uh maddie mari are you italian no i'm uh, armenian ancestry oh god i have worked the fields on my youth picking potatoes strawberries etc cool maddie i'm a I'm a potato and a, and a potato, potato. I'm a potato and a potato. Potato and a potato. Yes, Chicho, exactly, exactly. Maddie, redeem 100 points. Woo! By the way, Maddie, uh, you can save all your points as well. Uh, what we started to do last year was uh, do auctions where people can bid points on certain items that we're auctioning off and then if they win the auction we redeem the points and i sent off the packages to them we had comic books jam honey and a couple of books rare books on uh, entheogens beer oxygen kills your plans to stop daylight savings right i i think certain places are trying to right oh my god you have 150,000 points <laughs> nice <laughs> 
And gang, don't forget, free Assange, free Assange, free Assange. Julian Assange is a journalist and publisher that is being crucified for trying to bring transparency and accountability of capitalist power to humanity. Okay, for more information, see wikileaks.org, defend.wikileaks.org, or our Julian Assange and WikiLeaks playlist on Sensor 2. There's the kitty cats. You want to see them play while we chit chat? They love, they love this tunnel. They absolutely love the tunnel. Because farmers can't adjust their own. Yeah, it's central control, right, Gina? Right, it's central control. What is that symbol? I can't see it. I don't know what it is. Via loves the tunnel. likes pouncing on that sal's over here sal's over here just chilling chilling with a villain spark back ding bobber time is an illusion completely uh relative completely rather <laughs> completely relative uh it's a property of matter that's the way i look at it Okay, some things are not uh, graspable. For instance, a 2D being that is touched by a 3D being could only see the being in 2D just as we cannot see 4D plus being if there, there exists. Uh, we can see the shadow of it. And mathematics uh, reveal certain, uh, certain properties for higher dimensional uh, states of being, right? Leo, Maddie, you're Leo, elder goddess Virgo. I'm an Aries, Spark says. Chicho is not a Leo. I'm not a Leo. My grandma is a Leo. <laughs> Gina, Virgo rising. Nice, Maddie. What is his zodiac sign then? Libra? No, I'm Gemini. Supreme leader of Twitch. Aries here as well. No idea what it means though. <laughs> air sign one of the of this four of them right he kind of looks like a scorpio to me no no scorpios scorpio guys are uh, i have friends close friends that are scorpio guys but they're sort of need to be scorpio guys very emotional <laughs> huckleberry uh, i'm a libra what does that mean a Libra is in Libra balance. Don't know anything about astrology. Oh, you guys want the box? Okay, let me give you the box. Okay. Kitty cat coming for the box. You guys want the box? There you go. You gonna get in there? Want me to close it? Cats on boxes. <laughs> it's cozy. It is a cozy fire. It is a cozy fire. He's got a bounce on him. Oh, he's gonna bounce, they're gonna bounce each other. Are they? Are they? Oh. <laughs> Funny. Chicho, you should do a philosophy metaphysics stream. Maybe. We do. We do at some point. Sparks. Chicho, did you show the emote of a stream by chance? Off on. 
Uh, no, I don't know how to grab it. How do how do I grab it? I don't know how to grab uh, the emote. Uh, Maddie, Libras are way too nice. No offense, but I don't like them. Ah, uh, Maddie. Oh my god, I am too nice. I say sorry way too much. You must be Canadian too. Oh, well, you are Ding Bobber. Sal is getting up another accident. <laughs> they love this thing. Should we do a little view on the bottom? Let's see what that looks like. Cats are so weird. They love the box. They love the box. They love the box. Oh, he's gonna bounce on it. No, he decided not to. I feel like astrology is too categorical, and most people, if not, all fit into the multiple uh, astrological categories. Despite this, uh, Chinese astrology, the twelve years. Elder God, what are you in the 12 year cycle? Have you tried giving them catnip yet? Or are they too young? Uh, we tried, they, they weren't really too interested. So they were a little bit too young. Like they're, they're just getting out of the, they're teenagers, right? You're an ox, Elder God. Oh, water ox, water buffalo? Oh, there's three different types of oxes. This is your year. I'm a bunny, Spark says. Nice. Now the kid, now they're like fully awake. Water rocks. Elder God. Cool. Now the kitty cats are fully awake. Look at that. They love that box. Let this thing one get in again. There you go. There you go. This is this is this is uh, Sal. This is Via. Joy of being a kitty cat. <laughs> Be like water, Bruce Lee. You want the lid closed again? Yeah, we'll close it. Chicho, I know a spiritual teacher who promotes the power of 13. Jesus had 12 disciples making him so yeah 12 is everywhere 13 is everywhere 
And some people think 13 is unlucky, but 13 is lucky in certain religions and cultures, right? They're obsessed with the box. They are obsessed with the box. It is their, it is their ultimate toy right now. They love boxes and bags. We have bags that they love as well. Allah. <laughs> uh, I'm a rabbit according to a 30 second search. A wascoey rabbit. Jack Les Lescobar. Are you a wascoey rabbit? 738597 2009 Ox years. 13 is powerful. Hence the McDonald's logo subsequently being a 13. Is it? I don't know if that's true. Where do you go? Fun. Bureaucracy kills. Yeah, I'm not. Uh, I'm like Carl Sagan. It's, you know, it could be fun. Ninety-seven year old though. Ninety-seven year old though. Haha, -ha. you're an old soul, Maddie. An old soul is good. Being an old soul is fantastic. Right. Being an old soul is a good thing. You get to appreciate many things in the in the world. <laughs> they like hiding. <laughs> I always say say since we cannot fully understand reality, you might as well play with fun ideas and concepts to test their validity. Ding bobber, great saying. Great saying. All right, I upload the emo to my channel temporarily so you all can can see it. Awesome. <laughs> nice. <laughs> that looks great. Everybody refresh if you want to see see it in the in the chat. Nice. 11 and 17, not the same thing. Nice. Nice. It's perfect. That's a great emo that comes out fantastic as a little emo. Uh, what are you calling it? Uh, <laughs> nice. There's a little kitty cats. <laughs> Sparky three playtime. Sparky three playtime. That's what it's called. Sparky three playtime. I wonder if I can do it as well. Can I do it? How do you do it? Is it a? Uh, is it this? No, that doesn't do it. How do you? I don't think we can tell you the truth. Can we? No, we would have to upload it to our channel. We have to figure out. I gotta figure out how to do that. I'm not 100% sure how to do that. Oh, I think there's a way to do it. I think I looked into this before. Awesome. Thank you very much, Spark. It looks fantastic. Looks fantastic. I think it takes a little bit of time for emails to be uh, approved. So I'll have to check in. No problem, Asa. And uh, this thing here, the, the rainbow, this guy, we hung that on there. It's one of one of the things they love going up to and just biting it. For me, it's instant cause. I've never gotten in trouble on that. <laughs> yeah, our cats uh, like the cardboard. It's like kids too. Like people say, "Oh, what toy should you get kids? Get them cardboard boxes." They can do anything with the box or take them outside, find a mole, like a, a mound, a little hilltop, and they can play on that all day. Run this way, run that way, run around, create a fort, slide down. 
Thank you very much for the follow, Moose, and everyone else, of course. Uh, Ding Bobber, uh, we tried to have not yet. We'll try kit a catnip with them again later. And gang, don't forget, free Assange, free Assange, free Assange. Julian Assange is a journalist and publisher that is being crucified for trying to bring transparency and accountability of capitalist power to humanity. For more information, see wikileaks.org, uh, defend.wikileaks.org, or Julian Assange and WikiLeaks playlist on Sensor 2. Uh, Sparks, I just give a kid's paper and say go crazy. Yeah, they did a survey a while ago. They asked a lot of children around the world from the global south what would you like as a gift and a huge percentage blew away anything else was pen and paper that was their wish to get as a as a gift pen and paper right the kitty cats <laughs> they just play and like this corner they love this area it's look at they love scratching the box and biting the box. Chicho, free Assange, free Assange, free Assange has become a sound bite of yours indeed. <laughs> Seriously. That's so awesome, Spark says. I don't have to buy a, a buzz lightyear replica and anything super no. No. <laughs> it's almost musical. Thanks, Think Bobber. <laughs> Fun. Fun. Oops. Are you destroying the box? Are you destroying the box? Do you want to be covered again? I want to cover you again. I want to cover you. Get your tail in. Get your tail in. Your tail is exposed. Don't need to clean that sound. We're gonna throw in the wash later, okay? Yeah. yeah. This is sound. Say hi. Say hi. Don't scratch. Thank you for the follow, uh, Edda. I appreciate it. My cousin is almost bored of video games at 11 because of, at 5 he owned like 4 cons. Yeah. Yay. My chat's cleared. Oh my god. I have kept a diary since I was 20. Oh, really? All pen and paper. Something. Something's have to be off the grid. Something's have to be off the grid. And gang huge recommendation if you wanna if you wanna if you wanna if you wanna clear your thoughts uh and grow right uh and brainstorm and get things done have a pen and paper uh notepad and pen take notes right you don't have to clean this you don't have to clean this we're gonna throw in the wash, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay, Sam. You don't have to clean it. Yeah, you don't have to clean it. Ooh. 
<laughs> no, it's like, I'm gonna clean it. You don't have to clean it, it's all good. Love sprawling in front of the fire. It's crazy. They get so hot. So hot. Jack, Elder God. I love to have been alive then. I don't know. I feel like teenagers in the 80s weren't as uh, apathetic. But I could be way off. I noticed a real dip in our collective openness once we all got smart. It was different. I was the 80s was an uh, amazing time, amazing time. All times, really. But right now, the kids are under serious pressure. I'm going to say something. Technology is making you weak. Don't fall into the matrix. Uh, I tend to agree with the Elder God. Huckleberry or Chicho. You're an incredible cat parent. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thanks for the compliment, man. No, you don't need to. I know. You go bleep, poop you, but it's okay. I'm gonna throw this into the wash, okay? I'm gonna throw it. Come, chill with it. Yeah. Just throw them together and they wrestle. Oh, here comes Sal again. He's, he can't help it, right? His nose is picking up something. So he has to go there. I'm gonna remove this now. So you don't get distracted by it. No. Now he goes off. He's like, okay, that's out of my way. So anyway, Chicho, if you want to help with uploading that emote, uh, let me know um, on Discord. I'll be fine doing so. Okay, awesome. Thank you very much, Spark. And use the second one, right? So with that being said, I might take a quick nap. Sweet dreams, Spark. Thank you for uh, popping in and thank you for creating the emote. I appreciate it. Ningmar, uh, Ningmar to Allah God. You are right. Thank God for mushrooms. When it's warm, I'm going to be spending much time outdoors. I really do. And um, uh, meditate in the sun. Nice. Second one, yeah. Awesome. Thank you very much, Spark. Appreciate it. Nice chill time. Nice chill time, couple of hours before we kick it into heavy with current events discussion tomorrow. The kitty cats took off. Doing their thing. Whatever it is that they're doing. We almost only needed this view. But no, the bottom view was good. The bottom view was good. This top view wasn't as nice as I thought it could be. Maybe I had to move the camera a little bit further down right? and have it like a wide angle lens so it showed it. Here they come again. To me, honest people are so uh, scared these days. They just want to live, uh, thought their, live thought their mobile in mobiles instead of interacting live through uh, through their mobiles instead of interacting with the world sadly this makes the world get worse fortunately i am seeing some people saying this yeah i think that we're seeing a huge shift and people are uh, uh, are beginning to not interact with automated things as much as 
they are with uh, real human beings right like a lot of the chat online on social networks is bots right like it's crazy there's so many bots especially on sensor too right so I think that's one of the reasons why live streaming is picking up huge is because people want to make sure that the dialogue that's taking place is live with real human beings right the automation the machine learning is not there yet to mimic this live stream experience and it won't be there for at least another 10 years so this is an amazing time to do this uh, we'll see where it goes we'll see where it goes sorry my mobile is trying to stop me <laughs> gaming elder god the auto spelling stuff right <laughs> think however i would highly recommend guided visualization to explore your subconscious yeah meditation is fantastic guided i've never have i done i've done a couple of times uh for me uh, i didn't do too much guided or externally guided i guess people have souls they must protect this this asset yeah yeah i went through a portal in my mind yesterday chicho nice when I went through, I was in my pool this summer with music playing, sun shining, and that was it. I was super happy. Nice. Kasten turn. How are you doing? What you guys want? They might want food, some food. Gremlin 1995. Thank you. We're redeeming 1,000 points. <laughs> sure. I'm going to go check on the kitty cats, see what they're doing. I think they might they might want a little bit more food uh, but I'm not gonna give it to them I think they ate too much that's why they got a little sick this morning or when we started our live stream right so I'm gonna let them chill I opened up the patio door for them they really like going outside bye guys fun stream take care thing bobber hope you have a fantastic day and we're basically gonna call the stream game uh, we're almost up to two hours be safe don't fall for their tricks be safe and don't fall for their tricks and i think i think there's a lot of people waking up right now there's a lot of people that are looking at things and going wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute yeah what is it <laughs> the, the the voicey one is via usually enjoy your day everyone enjoy your day indeed huckleberry gang let's call the stream if you can make it tomorrow evening 8 p.m we do current events um tomorrow's monday evening 8 p.m we do current events tuesday we do ba -ba -da -da -da. tuesday we do health um food and health okay and then we've got a whole bunch of other ones lined up we do comic reading thursday i believe grading comics on friday minerals and crystals on saturday and so on and so forth jack thanks chicho take care ladies and gents take care ladies and gents gang if you want to know what this is all about i am on patreon patreon.com forward slash chicho chycho i don't put anything behind paywall everything's creative commons and Later on mathematics share and share a like have a good one everyone yeah you too as well max i don't want to die but to protect my friends i would do it gladly interesting times interesting times elder god gang for those of you that were supporting this work on patreon thank you very much for the support it is in large part because of your support that we're able to do this and continue this continue this for as long as we are 
And gang, don't forget, Free Assange, Free Assange, Free Assange. Julian Assange is a publisher and journalist that is being crucified for trying to bring transparency of, and accountability of capitalist power to humanity. For more information, see wikileaks.org, defend.wikileaks.org, or our Julian Assange and Wikileaks playlist on Sensor2, and the videos on Bichud and Rumble that we're going to be loading on. <laughs> don't even think <laughs> sounds sounds like i'm taking this apart gang we are live streaming on twitch if you want to participate in these live streams as they're occurring in the chat twitch is where you want to be at and gang thank you for the support thank you for the follows thank you for the subs thank you for being here the discussion sharing information and mods for taking care of business the box is back I do announce these live streams on four platforms parlor vk minds and gap okay i had a dream that you bought a mobile phone have you for me uh no not a new one but i did get a hand-me-down and i changed my uh changed my uh provider recently nice dream crazy dream i pay zero per month now for 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 cell phone zero dollars per month i went with the zero dollars one right hopefully stays zero dollars we do upload the audio for our live streams to soundcloud.com as long as we don't have any visuals we have visuals today and those audio files those podcasts should be available on your favorite podcasting platform including spotify and itunes i pay 20 pounds a month for 40 gigs awesome in canada ours is crazy expensive crazy expensive people are getting ripped off i know people that are paying 150 dollars 170 dollars a month canadian right most people pay over 100 a month canadian that's crazy as far as i'm concerned thousand everywhere else wow cool and we will be uploading the this live stream the video including the playtime the discussions and the kitty cats puking on sensor to bit shoot and rumble and if you're on those platforms you can support this work by following liking sharing commenting and if you're on sensor 2 you can support this work by joining sensor to membership and there's a button right below the kitty cat there somewhere five thousand minutes five thousand texts i mean five thousand texts that's a lot of texts man i maybe do a hundred a month if that look at them go the box is their favorite toy gang i hope you have a fantastic day if you can make it current events tomorrow night health and fitness tuesday night you do 100 a day wow wow i don't even do one a day sometimes i don't even do one a day for a week like i don't even do one a week sometimes gang i'll see you guys tomorrow if you can make it bye everyone are we doing meditation tuesday health and we're not gonna we might do meditation at the end we'll see i don't know if i'm gonna set it up that way but maybe because I do, I broke up my meditation into two different formats now. Where I'm doing a meditation, I'm doing some kind of sort of a stretching thing. Uh, I was thinking including a meditation stream in the next set. So maybe we'll do it then. Bye, everyone. I hope you have a fantastic day. Look at him go. <laughs> Fun. <laughs>